Oh, you saw, uh, yeah, we saw what the the dark edition that's going to be coming with the launch of the game. This is the dark mode. We had a chance to play. The, it, I'm going to be honest with you. It is. It's spooky. It's freaky. It's, it's awesome. It's it's dark. And a couple of the the maps do have. Obviously, you see it here as their cave night. There's night versions of these maps, but it changes the way you play completely. Jeff. Yeah, you absolutely can. And I mean, you have the option to turn on and turn off your night vision goggles, but I'll be honest, like some of us were testing it. You yeah. can't see much. You can hardly yeah. see anything without your night vision goggles on. And of course, if you aim in with your night vision goggles, you will, your laser pointer is out. So the enemy team can see you. So you have to make the, the decision. When am I going to zoom in? When am I not? So it's, it's, it's tough. It's a lot of fun though. And with the dark mode, the dark maps, there also is again, the dark edition. You can yes. pre-order that now and it is limited. It comes with the night fishing goggles. It comes with so all the camos cool. and skins you guys see. Uh, it's truly incredible, and that is available now on CallDuty.com. So if you want to go ahead and pre-order it, you can get that done. And, uh, yeah, one of the coolest editions we've ever yeah. had in the history of Call of Duty. But now we're going to kind of show off goggles. why there's been so much I research into night fishing. They're so fun. I, I can't be the only kid that, like, I don't remember why or when it was, but like I, I remember so growing I up, there was a point where I thought night vision goggles were the single coolest thing in the entire world, and I wanted yes, them. I and I asked my parents. I yesterday, I was mind blown. And my parents <laughs> were like, "Those cost thousands and thousands of dollars." Yeah. I was like, "Oh, that's tough. I'm not getting that." But <laughs> now you can. Oh yeah, no, we're taking. We already discussed this at yep. We're taking those with us. Absolutely. Absolutely. Let's play. We'll play tag tonight, dude, in the dark. <laughs> sure about this. Now, we're not going to do are that. Are you too old for tag? No, you're never too old for tag. <laughs> okay. I mean, I guess you guys are going in the game. I'm out, though. <laughs> 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 All right, let's get right into it. Uh, this is going to be some thrilling stuff. Again, never before seen multiplayer footage and gameplay from all these streamers here in attendance in Los Angeles. Thanks to Infinity Ward for having everybody out. But now let's check one of the night versions of the map. It's about to get spooky. And they're playing with realism as well. And what that is, that yes. takes away the HUD. And it, it is just, it's, it's insane. It's a, a very realistic experience. It's a very different type of experience. Here's a sniper. It's going to take players maybe a, a little long to get used to. Of course, that teep ups for the sniper. So rifle. we didn't see We didn't use the sniper when so, we played this. So, so when you snipe, you yeah, when you snipe, you can fully ADS as, as you're used to. Now, if you don't have a sniper rifle, your ADS Talk looks up a, a little different. Yeah, you tilt it, your gun with the, with the laser. But every time he aims, this is. every time he aims, I, I, I need everyone to realize you can see the lasers being aimed at, that's your kind of indication it, oh someone's close it almost looks Scary. like trailer footage right yeah. like if it wasn't for the names of your teammates it, it looks like something out like of like a pre-made pre pre video yeah it's really it looks really immersive this looks like a lot of fun i didn't get a chance to play this yet but you know, having that night vision on and being in this cave too it just looks a bit scary and, and again you can you know take your night vision off but as kind of merc teased probably don't recommend it it's pretty no, dark there's like there's like some like <laughs> I don't know, there's some flames that'll help you out. There's some lights in the cave, but it, you, again, you cannot see much. Well, he finally tries to find an opening, ends up getting flanked, so oh, no, no kill in for TP. Th this TP is where changes classes. This is where Teep's gonna pull out the MP5, 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 but you can yeah. see, so when he zooms in, that laser comes out. So you can't see it until that, correct? Correct. Yep. And that's kind of what you use to, to, to guide your aim, if you will, the laser pretty much perfectly Shows you where the bullets. I'm just go. imagining playing against like Maven in this, and he's just in a random corner. And I oh, just I'm gonna be, I'm just be laying life. down somewhere. Yeah. For that's some reason, that's basically what you did when you played this. No, you, you it laid scares down me. Right. Did you ever see the Descent, like that scary movie in the caves when you were a kid? No. This oh, makes dude, me think that movie. Ter for some reason, it makes me think of the Descent, man. I think there's gonna be monsters so coming out of the corners. Kid? Oh yeah, oh yeah. So you <laughs> were in 55 years. You were in the womb. Yeah. I wasn't. No. That was a long time ago. Oh, here we go. Keep with the chance to pick up a couple of kills. And again, realism on. So, you know, you, you just got to have to. It's one, one bullet well, to the head. Like, it's quick. Well, once, yeah, it's different, too, because you don't have, like, the normal hit markers, too. Exactly. Yeah, I was like, I remember when we first played it, I was like, I, I couldn't. Is he dead? Tell, yes, yeah. exactly. But no, the, the realism of his is wild. You just see how, like, cautious he's playing, because it's hard to even, like, where are my teammates? Where are the fights going down? It's so hard, you know, with that realism mode on. Yeah, teamwork and communication. Going to have to be on point. But you can see it looks like they've got a personal radar in top left for Shroud. Some nice shots there as well from Shroud. Some very, very nice shots. And this was actually the map that we, we played, the, the, the night map. And it was what, that outside <laughs> area? Right there, I'm <laughs> jumping back. <laughs> yeah, dumb out. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, and then, oh, you actually see, that, that was that a perfect moment. Yeah, took up the night vision. Yeah. I, I don't know if we can go find that player who's not using the Noah, night vision. but I think Noah was just using it because he was like outside the cave. Like it's okay. a lot brighter out there. I wonder if Noah is just like messing around and not using it. Maybe. I mean, 
and can give you an advantage, that's for sure. Because he's just, just, it looked like he was just running around with a shotgun. He's <laughs> <laughs> like, I'm going to kill everybody. And there's a quick glance at the... close game. The scoreboard very close, 24-23, and that's something, uh, again, because you are really... <laughs> <laughs> trying to go out of the map, like, up, uh, up the hill. Well, that's what's in... You know, they talked about sort of the going away from sort of the arena style maps and more to like the realistic yep. maps as they did research for these. And yeah, I found myself like trying to learn it where as well. Exactly. Yeah. Where can I go? And that's just going to come obviously with putting time into the game. But it's like you're in this little like realistic sandbox and you get to discover everything. It's 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 the best game. advice you can really give when, when people start playing is Ooh. don't unnecessarily aim. Right, because you do not want the other team to get the information. They'll see your laser sight. You want to try and keep yourself hidden for as long as possible. Otherwise, exactly what happened to Myth there. Uh, we'll, we'll I, thought he got, I thought he got sniped for a second. But. Well, he saw like three people run across his screen. I think that's why he was frustrated and just gets popped. Tough. Real tough is now. Quick lights over towards Skadoodle's perspective. Did they say how many modes or how many maps this is going to be for? Like I, I know they said the dark mode is for some maps. Is it every map or just a handful of? I think it's a handful. One. Yeah. I no, think I think that makes more sense. I just couldn't remember if they, they they broke that down when we had them up here. Yeah, we're seeing the action start to take place. You know, outside now the cave got a little bit too scary for these guys. <laughs> they didn't know where they were dying from. Well, it feels like you can get like better power positions yeah. and height in some of these buildings. Versus, yeah, the, the cave is terrifying. <laughs> yeah, it's just scary. <laughs> <laughs> There's a lot of corners that you have to check as well, which is always, always tough as home players there we go. Right back in towards the cave. Well, I feel like this is going to be, so I, I've never been like the biggest, uh, like hardcore mode player, but obviously there's a oh. giant community for that. Like, I feel like this is going to be awesome. I mean, Dave, someone that loves like the hardcore side. Call of Duty 4 is when the hardcore community really just, you know, took off and, you know, it was massive back then. People loved it. So I feel like this has got to be something they'd be into. Absolutely. Right? <laughs> no, but <a laughs> you see the Claymore? <laughs> oh, that'd be so. Oh, we got, oh, we got a gunship! Oh. How did he oh. manage to get a gunship? Here we go. Light oh, it up! Well, the, the problem is, there's a giant cave. <laughs> so I'm not sure how effective this is actually going to oh, be. Oh. Found him. But they're they're inside of me, not. I mean, he's not going to know either when he hits him. Oh, uh, he'll know. So that red square like, is going like to disappear. There. He's like, they're in there. Well, he's now funneled everyone into the cave. Well, his teammates are picking up some kills right now. We just saw two of the squares drop. Yeah, he's basically a UAV for his team. Got to catch them all spawned. <laughs> and and fire. Oh, I don't think he realizes what's in the sky right now. Oh, oh. still alive. One player outside. Yeah, Don't want to be there. Found one. He found one. Yeah. Oh, that 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 person just got obliterated. Well, actually, a couple of players are going to come out spawn if he predicts this. <laughs> up top. Yep. Up top should be good for at least a couple. That player just spawned up and saw a rocket <laughs> flying from the sky, <laughs> landing at his feet. Like if it already wasn't frightening enough with the, the <laughs> night like, vision. <laughs> now you're getting drilled in the face with missiles from up above. Oh, he's doing this with a shotgun and claymores. Noah is my worst enemy. <laughs> <laughs> nice kill. Unfortunately. Shot to the he's side. He's smiling. He's having so much fun. I mean, the score was unbelievably close a few moments ago. It's 54-46 right now. No, oh, I think he did just pick up that kill. But over to towards Jericho's perspective now. We'll see uh, how much luck he's going to have. I mean, we were watching TP. You could see how he was just cautiously checking every corner. Jericho's like, nope, I want a challenge. Sprinting straight through that tunnel. And you can see players are getting more comfortable with the power positions now. I mean, once you, again, learn the map, you learn the power yep. positions, and especially in a game mode like this, makes things a, a, a little different. Well, I think the good thing is they played, like, uh, you know, one map on this before. Yeah. I yeah. think when we jumped into it, it was our this first, was time. first time yeah. on oh, this yeah, map. Yeah. I was like, I don't know where I am. I just stopped moving. I was like, I, yeah, I you became a snake up. in the grass. Yeah, That's yeah, what you did. You lay outside the cave, and you just kind of waited for people to run yeah, out. And yeah, to your exactly. credit, you killed everyone. This is my part of the map. Don't come near me. Uh -huh. It's Maven's <laughs> domain. Nice pick there from Jericho. I think he sees the layout. I think that was a headshot. Okay. Nice shot from Jericho. So it looks like Ooh. these scopes you can zoom all the way into. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it looks like with the 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 mini reflex, you couldn't aim all the way in, but sniper rifle you definitely can because that's what we sort of yep. straight yeah. off the rip. Didn't use it for Probably very long. No. It was a death and he was Probably like, just yeah. on the scope, yeah. Let me go to the sub. Very close game though. I believe it's just down to four kills now. We'll see this closed out relatively soon. But again, biggest advice when you when you hop on this in open bed, don't ADS unnecessarily. Nice shots. Clean shots, actually. I wonder if Looking he for the one tap. Ooh, almost found the kill up top. And we don't know if he got him, and he doesn't know. Yeah, so he doesn't he's, know. Yeah, he's just kind of hoping. Killed that guy though, which is cool. The realism part yeah. of it, right? It's like I don't know if I can push this yet. Oh, and takes off the night vision goggles. So that's why you'll see some players be a little bit more cautious because. If they're like shooting through the wall, you won't know. That's tough. Defeat 75-62. Uh, it was close at one point. 
Unfortunately for Skadoodle and Co, they're not going to win that map. Actually, went faster, I, faster than I thought it would. Like I thought the gameplay would slow down quite well, a bit. Well, that was the thing when, when we played.